Hey everybody out there on YouTube. Um, I'm making a live video, but of course you can hear there is no music. We'll get to that. Okay, um, first thing I just want to recap is that makeup show. I'll list the information on the sidebar. It's coming up May 18th and 19th. My son's right here. If you see the curtain, move that to him. Um, but that's for pros only. So, next topic. Why it's silent. The, I did a still um, video using a song. The last one I did, the Jamaican Eye, using a song. And YouTube contacted me saying that the owner of the song was okay with me using it. But that they were going to watch the ratings and watch the comments and um, see how many hits it got. And this is all public. It's not anything that they went into my account and blah blah blah. And that right and that they were okay with it. Um but it spooked me a little bit. So I contacted um YouTube and they didn't contact me back, but I read on their on the, you know, information for the copyright page. Just some general information and I just read out loud to myself and really familiarized myself with it and also um, familiarized myself with um, some outside sites also. Um, so you guys should check that out about, about what music you use in your backgrounds. Like I said, I didn't get in trouble. I'm not really... I was spooked about it before, but I'm not anymore. Because um, they're advertising on that. Um, they're advertising anyway. So on that video. Okay, um, I actually did contact Corin because I know he had had an issue with the song that he used to put on the front, on the, on his opening, and I know he said something about it in the, one of his videos, and then when I contacted him, he said that he is trying to get the rights from whoever owns that song, but that it's going to take a long time because it's a big company. Anyway, so that's that. I'll write the information about what I have on, um, on my face right now, which is nothing crazy. I just don't come in front of the camera without makeup. But I did want to show you, it's this LA Colors palette, the dollar store finds, okay? And I just used this color right here, this purple color. And it's over Yogurt um, NYX Crayon. And on my lips, I'm, I'm showing you right now. I don't know why I told you. Um, Max uh, Lore that came out in 06 or 05. And then Smashbox Glaze. Okay. Oops. And NYX. What is this called? Frosted Beige. Beige. That's not the color in the store because it got mixed with other lipsticks or whatever. Okay, just checking if my son was being illegal. Um, okay, so that is about the music. And next, um, I know you guys are waiting on that, um, my lore samples, the review for that. That's a bag of them, like 14 of them. I've used a few of them in video so far. Um, I am still going to do a formal review on them. I just bought glycerin and a little bottle to make um, the mixing medium and that's going to be via, via Encore's um, video um, so I'm going to be doing that soon so that review is going to be coming up soon okay um oh I skipped that's fine okay and I also talked about the review. That's fine. I write everything down. I'm like a 90 year old. If I don't write it down, I'm going to forget it. Okay, um, I guess I'll go through what I bought the past few days. It's not that much, but, um, some of it swaps, but it's like literally like a week of stuff. So I got this at Target, at Walmart. $6.99. I believe now my friend told me there's Lash Blast with, um, a trio of eyeshadows. So, this was like two weeks ago with the eyeliner. But I love this liner for a pencil. It's an automatic pencil, but I really love it. It's called um, Perfect Point Plus. I got that in black. 
Then yesterday I went to Dollar Store and I had CoverGirl there too. Super thick lash in a brown black mascara. And I don't normally use brown black mascara because I have like minimal lashes. So I like to use black so you can really see it. But I'm glad it was only a dollar because now I won't feel bad about using it, about getting it. Um, then I went to Sally's and I got these two little eyeshadow things. I believe they clicked together. I think Miss Butterfly um, did a rainbow eyes with some with um with Sally Girl products, so I went and I tried it, so I didn't open it yet. And plus I'm low on greens. I don't know how that happened. But I'm low on bright green color, so I went with this. That's glow green and golden bronze. Okay, that was at the dollar that was at Sally's for their 99 cents each. And I got this loose glitter because we were talking on make M U A, can't say it, um, about wanting a loose glitter and this looks really fine. The glitter, I know you can't see it. I don't even know why I'm wasting the camera time. But anyway, looks really fine. So and then I got this Revlon Plum Like It Hot. It's a little sheer, but it says sheen, so maybe that's what it is. Um, I got this in a swap. I knew that it was damaged. I'm going to repress it and clean it up, so don't worry about that. I got the Hip Black Smashbox Deadline. It's like a pink color. Um, in a swap also. Came perfectly packaged. Um, I got a flirt brush, blending brush, and a swap. It's not brand new, but hello, I'm going to clean it. I got these two brushes, Low and Corning's brushes, one for liner and one for that new technique with the black that I'm starting to do a lot that I really like. Um, they were 30% off at AC Moore for, they were less than $3. I'm talking a little fast because I think my time is about to run out in two minutes, so. Um, don't sleep on Wet n Wild. I did. I used to a long time ago when I, before makeup, and then I was talking to MUA and everyone was saying, oh, Wet n Wild, Wet n Wild. So I went and I tried it, the limited edition, the green. Very pigmented. I did put it over hip, but that's all I had on my eyes, and this was a little dry, and it came out really nice. So then, of course, I went back, and I got two other ones. These are like under three bucks, so... You know, how that goes. Oh, I got this in a swap, too. It came a little bit damaged, but I'm never going to use this whole thing out anyway. So if a little chips off, I don't care. That's just me. Oh, okay. And I also got this from the Heirloom um, Mac. From the Heirloom, I think it was Heirloom, last year Christmas? Not this Christmas. I think the, the year before? No, I can't remember. I got in a swap from Maggie. Maggie, hi! Um, very pretty, came perfect, silver. I like it. Um, that's it for my haul. I just wanted to show you guys the Harmon catalog. Harmon's only in three states, Jersey, Connecticut, and New York, so I'm sorry. Um, but they have, let me list some stuff that they have. A dollar off Max Factor, blush, Almay Eye Products, Revlon stuff, Posh brushes, a dollar off. I didn't end up buying it because, um... I knew I was going to go to the craft store, and I like long handle ones. I don't really like short handle ones, but they're dollar off. Um, what else? They have dollar off hip stuff. It's not buy one, get one. It's just dollar off, which I thought was nice, because, you know, well, whatever. Um, that's pretty much it for the cosmetics, but um, they have a lot of health and beauty stuff there. So, that's it. I'm not sure what I'm going to do about music for my still videos anymore. Um, I might just skip it all together. Anyway, bye guys. I'll talk to you later. Any information or questions, just leave a comment. Bye.